Hello, here's an episode of Air Pruning Plants where I'll describe the method used to plant these durian and meringue seedlings. So here we have a basic air pruning pots as described to build by John Morris, which you can find his PDF online. Just type in John Morris and PDF and you can find that booklet. So these are meringue seeds and basically when the seeds are planted in these pots, once they contact the air they thicken and harden and the dryness will store the carbohydrates in these roots and then once they're planted back into a next rooting medium or into the ground um, they can shoot out roots from these spots more vigorously based on the stored carbohydrates um, also when these roots are dried contacting the air they put out more amphitious roots and stopping the tap root from growing which commonly swirls and um, gets root bound in a typical pot but in these, it'll keep putting out adventitious roots, which absorb more nutrients and create a stronger, healthy plant. Also, while transplanting these plants, they will be more um, vigorous and more res resistant to the transplanting shock, which is another advantage. And then once these are put into their next step, I'll tilt them, as I just showed you with that uh, meringue tray. And I'll take out half the seeds so they have more space and then tilt them so the roots can grow down a more vertical distance. Um, yeah, so that's basically it. Over here I've got some grafted plants that I bring from Costa Rica. I've got a cunyet durian and a red jackfruit, which I've sl slanted, as I was just describing to you, so they have more space to grow. And, yep, so that's basically it. I'll keep you guys updated if you're curious about how this is going. And... Yeah, that's an air pruning method for planting pots and why it works and why I do it. Alright, on the right we have the air pruning pot. These are the same age, same soil, different pots. This is from the air pruning pot or um, container. And this is from a plastic container. I'll show you. Just like one of these. With holes in it. So that's the difference so far.